it's always hard to believe that another three months has come and gone. One of the challenges of being a full-time traveler like we are here at don'tforgettopackthekids.com is that, uh, well, one, we constantly have to move to new places. That's just challenging, but it's also incredibly fun and fulfilling and awesome. Uh, but it's interesting because every time you go to a new country, you kind of have this huge impact of it's a new country. I'm so excited. It's such a big deal and we're moving and and we pack everything up and we go to a new place and we settle in and we get to know a community and we get to know the grocery store and we get to know the fruit delivery guy and we get to know uh, all the intricacies of taking out the garbage and how the plumbing works and electrical problems with the house and where the local playgrounds are and uh, how many of the local cats are going to stop by and what's going to try to sneak into your house and are there scorpions and just everything and you spend all this time and become part of the community and get to know people and like the kids here have made friends at the playground and then as soon as you know it three months is up your visa is expired and it's time to move on to another country and what at the beginning seemed like this overwhelmingly enormous move to in this case italy suddenly becomes something that's over and it's time to make another move to another country and that seems like a big move but doing so is it's in some ways mentally taxing but the thing that's really amazing is how doing something like moving to a new country feels so big at the time that you're planning it and when you first arrive and then to realize what a really simple short thing it is to have done once you've done it and you know being here in Italy now for three months and uh and leaving in the morning uh, to, well, to go to the airport is interesting because we were for so long, for a year, we've been looking forward to being in Italy. And, and now that we've been here, that time is up and all that planning and all that mental you know, preparedness is spent. And, uh, and now we get to move on to the next thing, which we're very excited about and looking forward to, and, and all the possibilities that may happen there uh, loom before us and, and you know, we look forward to that, but it's, I think when you look at it from the outside, it seems like each move must be so big and so dramatic and so involved. And in reality, it's not. It's so much easier than it seems uh, just because um, it's it, three months flies by, six months flies by. You don't even really notice the time and you're able to live a normal life and it doesn't have the drama and it doesn't have the, the effort that you initially imagined. And so it's, uh, uh, I, I always find it interesting. Every time we go to move to a new place, I always sit and kind of contemplate what mental place I was in before we came here and, and where I am when we're leaving and what things have changed and, and how long it's been. And it's, uh, it's interesting. So we're looking forward to the next adventure and getting ready to leave here. We've only got uh, 15 minutes left here in the park before it's time to go. So don't forget to uh, like and subscribe. Check us out at don'tforgettopackthekids.com. I'm Scott Allen Miller and uh, we are working very hard on bringing more and more content to you. Um, so hopefully very soon you'll have a lot of stuff from us. Thanks.